Hi everyone, this is Neha Bala Regulated Canadian Immigration Consultant and today I am back with uh, the latest IRCC update about express entry application processing time. So this is the update you guys are waiting for from so long. And also we are going to talk about the uh, major advantages of entering the pool right now. So this is the best time to enter the express entry pool. We'll talk about the advantages why you should enter this pool right now. And also in this video, uh, I'm going to tell you about a free assessment tool which our company is offering to you. So prior to the pandemic, the Canadian government aimed that it should uh, process all the express entry applications within six months. But what happened was that due to the pandemic situation, the applicants who have applied for express entry, they have to wait much longer than the earlier stipulated time of six months. So in fact, even the non-Canadian experience class applicants, they have waited for as long as 20 months for IRCC to give a decision on their applications. But fortunately, good news for you guys, IRCC has recently confirmed that it will soon be processing most of the new express entry applications within six months. But this will take effect once IRCC resumes its express entry invitations to FSW, FST, CEC candidates in early July. As the draws are resuming in July, but the preparations should start now. So, you know, as it takes time to prepare your profile, to submit your profile to the IRCC website. So, you should consider beginning the process right now. You see, you need time. You need time for booking your IELTS test. You have to prepare for your IELTS exam. You have to give the exam, then wait for its results. And in addition, you also need to time to get your ECA done. That is the education credential assessments done. If you don't know how to do that, um, uh, I have a complete video on uh, ECA. You can go and watch that video about ECA. What is ECA and how to get it done. So you need time for these things. You need time for IELTS. You need time for uh, your ECA and gathering other necessary documents. So it's a time consuming process. So please consider preparing your profiles, preparing everything right now. Now talking about the major advantages if you enter the express entry pool before July. So that is before the draws resumes. So talking about those advantages, the first major advantage is that uh, even though FSW draws are resuming in July, but IRCC continues to hold bi-weekly uh, express entry draws to invite the PNP candidates. So if you are in the pool, you get a chance to be invited by a province or any territory. And if you are nominated by a province or a territory, uh, then you are virtually guaranteed to get a PR invitation from the IRCC at federal level. Now talking about the second advantage. So you get an advantage in case IRCC uh, needs to use its tiebreaker rule. Now what is this tiebreaker rule is, when suppose multiple candidates have the same uh, CRS scores, which the IRCC has declared as a cutoff score. So suppose like uh, 500 persons, they all have uh, 480 scores, but IRCC needs 300 from that. So uh, how it will choose? So it will declare a tiebreaker rule that uh, it will give preference to those candidates who have entered the pool, who have uploaded their profile at an earlier date. So the earlier you upload your profile, you have entered the profile soon, the better the chances you have in case there is a tiebreaker rule. So yes, as I told you, this is the right time to enter the express entry pool. Uh, so our company is providing a free assessment tool to you guys. So I have pasted a, a link of the free assessment, free eligibility assessment form in the description. You can go to our website, you can press that link and you can see that for assessment form. So you can fill that form and uh, submit that form to us. So you can expect a response from us in seven to eight days. And uh, in uh, with that uh, free eligibility tool, we'll tell you uh, on the basis of your the, of the details you have provided that whether you are eligible to apply for express entry or not. So and in case you are uh, also eligible for some provincial programs, we'll let you know. And uh, then if you want, you can retain our uh, full representation services and uh, apply your express entry profile with us. I hope our video was of help to you guys. And if you like the video, do subscribe our channel. And also if you want to stay updated about IRCC updates and any new news and policies related to Canadian immigration, don't forget to subscribe our channel. 
and also if you like the video do share it with your friends and relatives and don't forget to fill the assessment form for your eligibility